Hey, it's Mr. H, and there's been a lot of talk about what social distancing is going to look like in schools in the fall. So I went into Desmos and made a simulation and got a little carried away, and I sort of made a game. The link is in the description to this video to get to this graph so that you can modify it and enjoy it in whatever way you would like. But I'm just going to walk you through how this kind of game that I've built operates. The idea is that you are the red circle, the teacher in this simulation. And you have a three foot radius. And all of the green dots, which are the students, also have a three foot radius. So as long as you don't overlap, that means that you will be maintaining a social distance of six feet from any other person in the room. And the idea is you're trying to get from the starting corner of the room over to the hand sanitizer in the far corner because we all know how important hand sanitizer is. Now, the idea is it's a little bit like Frogger where you're trying to uh, not get touched or not get, get too close to these uh, other people in the room. But you can see that even with only eight students in the room, and this is quite a large room, 55 feet by 35 feet, uh, that's an, a very large classroom. And as we go up to different uh, levels of difficulty, we're now kind of at a medium level of difficulty. There's a student aide uh, that is attached to that uh, student to help them. So now you can't get through in that area. You'll also notice we now have a lot more students. This is a much more normal size class, 24 students in a classroom. But notice in order to maintain the social distancing, you would need to have a 75 foot by almost 60 foot classroom. And you can see just how difficult it is to get through here. So as I zoom in, you can see that kind of in this game simulation, you can slow down and you can really try to carefully go through here, but... <laughs> Okay, sometimes it's a little bit more difficult to get through than other times. Okay, Whew. all right, we made it. All right, we're home free. Just one more row and we can get over to our hand. Oh, oh, no. Come on. Ah, okay, well, all right, so we'll be wearing masks in the fall because we'll definitely not be able to maintain the social distancing. That's what the simulation game is showing me at least. All right, and now I know that what you really wanna see is hard mode. So let's try to get back through. Uh, okay, okay, trying. Uh, can you imagine as a teacher squeezing through the rows of students because little Jimmy in the back has a question? Um, it's just, it's amazing to even try to imagine how this is going to look. Okay, so let's look at hard mode in our simulation. I tried to add a little bit of fun for you in this. So here we go. And murder hornets. Okay. There's murder hornets in the classroom. Now, I thought that this would be kind of, kind of funny. Um... There's also some other things that I've added into the file uh, just for your enjoyment that are not in this video. But if you like this Desmos video, if you'd like to see my challenge videos and my tutorial videos, then please remember to subscribe. Uh, and don't forget to get this file out of the link in the description uh, because I think it's really quite a lot of fun to play this game. So. If you have um, ideas for other things in Desmos that you'd like to see, then just toss those in the comments down in the description. Uh, you know, look through everything that I've got and kind of see if you're interested in subscribing to my channel. All right, well, before I go, I'm, I need to try this hard mode. So I am just going to say that I've put on a mask. I'm, I'm wearing... Uh, the proper face mask equipment to be within six feet of these students. So I'm still going to try to get through, but uh, in hard mode, this is very, very difficult. So uh, mainly, I just want to try to get past these murder hornets up to the front of the classroom. So this is a very, very full classroom. I mean, imagine if, if there was a situation you had this many students 
in an enormous classroom where you could try to maintain this distance. The students are wiggling all over the place. You're, you've got murder hornets flying in the windows. And of course, some other situations that I've also added to the file. So don't forget to check out that file in the description. I hope you've enjoyed uh, this episode. I finally made it to the hand sanitizer. So please don't forget to subscribe and comment below with all sorts of different things you'd like to see in Desmos. Thanks.